Hi, Dad. Do your children work you to try and get something from you that they couldn't get from their mom? This can happen a lot because really we're two different people and you actually want to have two different people as parents and by design, parents are going to usually be different. And so one of them will be more lenient and the other one will be uh, have a stricter style. One of them will have a bent towards artistic things maybe where one of them has a more intellectual style. But it doesn't really make any difference. The real key is your kids will understand which is which and how to work each side against the middle. So it's very important as parents to have a united front. Now that doesn't mean that you don't combine your strengths because I've always felt that in the best case, it would be that one good parent is available to each child because they have two individual parents. I know that's not possible in all situations, but that can also work through having uh, a situation where an uncle or an aunt or someone else in their life can fulfill those roles. And I think grandparents and aunts and uncles will play a very important part in the development of kids. But back to this issue of having a united front. Now, what we're talking about is the fact that there are different styles, and I think that's great, and I think parents need to do that. But the other thing is they don't need to let them care, their kids work them. So that means we need to talk. We're back to communication. I hate to come back to this, but the real deal is when your kids are working you, if you're not able to communicate and say, wait a second, I need to talk to your mother about that. I need to have time to think about that. And that when you talk about it, you come to an answer so that you can give the benefit to your children, especially your daughters, guys, the benefit of another opinion. Because they many times will say, well, yeah, Dad, but you just don't understand. You're not a girl. Well, guess what? Mom is a girl. So I'm going to talk to her and I'm going to figure this out. So that's what we're talking about. So don't be afraid to take your own authority and to and be a parent and make a decision. But also don't be afraid to say, you know, I need to talk to your mother about this because this is important and I want to get her perspective. So dads, we need to go both ways. We need to understand that sometimes we need to make a decision instead of just defaulting and say, well, dad, talk to your mother. But we also need to take time and say, you know, I need to talk to your mother about this because this is an important decision that's important to you. So it's easy to just say, I'm the guy, here's what it is, I'm going to make a decision. But I think many times it's important to involve a united front with both parents so you can make a quality decision and get the perspectives that both of you have. Thanks for stopping by.